How's it going, Tori? <laughs> it's good. Hello, everyone. Hi. Hey, everybody. Why do you look so tired? Because I'm mad. Because I am tired. <laughs> look at that outfit. Ow, ow! Did you check my show nail polish out. <laughs> oh. Cute. Apparently, if you, like, shake your leg all the time, it's, like, really bad for your nervous system. <laughs> my nervous system's already shot. I'm not <laughs> A precedent analysis on the uh, Air Force Chapel on the Air Force Base in Colorado Springs, Colorado, built by SOM. Lead designer, uh, Walter Nitsch. To everyone watching at home, play that back and look that up in Google if you would like. It's really cool. The, the whole concept of the building was like to have a religious, like, everyone on um, the campus who schools there can go based on one particular religion. There's three different chapels. Jewish synagogue uh, on the bottom as well, but that's only, they picked those because it was like the primary like religions of the time, and, um, but underneath, oh, there are like three levels, we had to like diagram the building a bunch. What are you doing? <laughs> Falling asleep? No. I say one more thing about it. Okay. <laughs> There's, um, using certain materials, using new technology, the Air Force, or ideas of the Air Force like modernistic technologies. You should just look it up. It's really cool. So, so. what's the theme for the week? <sighs> Something that I don't know anything about. Everything about politics just flies right over my head. And like certain situations or like certain topics I understand and I it's like okay that's a political debate or whatever and I have a stance on it but I don't know. I don't know about politics. So I guess you, I'm assuming that the topic of this week is politics. Um, well, you shouldn't assume. <laughs> You're making an ass out of both of us. Like, I f have a stance on, like, abortion. Like, anything that relates, like, strictly to an individual or, like, someone who would be, like, suppressed for a certain reason or, like, is someone who isn't getting rights that they should get. Like, that's something for me that I'm, like, passionate about. I guess about. No, that's good. So basically, you would stick up for whoever's being oppressed in a situation. Yeah. It sounds like you're very feminist. What is that supposed to mean? Whoever's being oppressed should be defended. Uh, yeah. So, that's what it sounds like to me. That's funny. So, um, it doesn't have to do anything with, like, because I'm a female? No. It's, See, that's... It's confusing, I that's know. That's confusing. Tell everyone in... In closing, what we're doing this week? Um, politics. <laughs> <laughs> and we can take it in whatever direction we want. Um, we're doing politics. This week. This week. And we're taking it in a whole different lots of ways. <laughs> I don't know what's good. <laughs> That's perfect. Don't no, worry about not. it. <laughs> no, <it's not. laughs> you can sing about politics. What else can you do about politics? <laughs> you can shove it up your butthole. This is funny because I don't, I can't work YouTube. If you email me or something on there, <laughs> chances are I've probably never seen it <laughs> because I never, I think I commented someone back one time and that was pretty much all that ever happened because I was like, I don't know what, I don't know. It's <laughs> like I can't, I can't even. YouTube is a foreign object to you. Yes. It's like worse than Twitter. 